I'm Austin Davis. I'm the senior aquatic biologist at the San Antonio River Authority. I'm going to be talking about the native freshwater mussel reintroduction project that we have here at the San Antonio River Authority. Uh, after the completion of the Mission Reach Restoration Project here in San Antonio, we were seeing a lot of bounce back of the ecosystem in terms of the in-stream habitat, uh, riparian habitat, uh, the bird species that were uh, coming back into the area. And we could see improvements in water quality and fish populations within the Mission Reach. And the last piece of that puzzle ecologically was bringing back freshwater mussels into the Mission Reach that haven't been there in many, many decades. And that's through uh, urbanization within the uh, San Antonio, downtown San Antonio area. And so what this project seeks to do is to bring mussels back into the restored Mission Reach. And we've decided on bringing four species of mussels back into the upper San Antonio River. Those are a yellow sand shell, pimpleback, pistol grip, and three ridge mussels. So before we put mussels out in the river, what we're doing is we're going through and we're tagging each individual mussel so we can go back and find them over time. So we know which mussels were placed there by our staff and came from a hatchery. And then we can distinguish those between the ones that are wildly reproducing. So we can see if the population is healthy and successfully reproducing on its own. And so how we do that is we're putting a little etch marking on the exterior of the shell of the mussels. And we're also going through and putting what's called a pit tag on them so we can go back and rescan. And we know that mussel one, two, three grew from 10 millimeters to 20 millimeters to 30 millimeters over time. And we can track the health of the population over time using those pit tags.